Tears of the Kingdom has me hooked. The characters, the gameplay, the world we have to explore. Last time in Tears of the Kingdom, we accidentally reawakened the Demon King at the bottom of Hyrule Castle, causing the world to fall apart and Zelda to disappear. Upon recalling some memories and saving the Rito Village from a deadly blizzard parasite, we uncover that Zelda is stuck in the past. In order to save her, we must find more of Hyrule's memories scattered across the world and delve into the underground with a darker past than any of us realized. There's probably more answers uh, about the memories at the Forgotten Temple. Okay, there's a shrine right here. Oh, and Impa's right here. Yeah, okay. So this is probably where we learn more about the geoglyphs. Thank you again for your help with the balloon. I believe there's something related to geoglyphs somewhere within this temple. I'm searching, but so far it has been in vain. Where could it be? Okay, so there's something here about geoglyphs that we have to discover. Now, could it be in here? Oh, my God. The goddess statue has fallen over. But could it be behind the goddess statue? Yeah, because this wasn't open in Breath of the Wild before. Like, you could... What in the cult meeting is this? Oh my god. This is like the representative of the six sages. This is the the, the lotus flower that we saw with Tu Lin back at the first dungeon. Well, okay, that's that has something about the geoglyphs in there. Oh. Oh my god. And this is the map of all of the geoglyphs. That's this is so cool. Wow. Oh. There upon the walls. Are those not geoglyphs? What could this mean? Yeah. I believe that was the one that we first saw on the left edge of the wall. It seems like the locations of the other geoglyphs from the wall are marked on the floor map as well. Like if you happen to see a geoglyph during your travels, I urge you to investigate this matter as well. If more strange visions are waiting at the other geoglyphs, well, perhaps they'll provide clues that can lead us to Princess Zelda. This is so cool. What's, wait, what is this? A tear with a tear. A tear with a tear? I hate English. Okay, yeah, I guess let's go discover this, this next geoglyph. Yeah, there it is. Okay, there it is. There it is. There it is. Okay, here's the next geoglyph. We need to find out where the tier is on here. So we need to look around the geoglyph and it should be like, oh, I, I found it. <laughs> nice. All right. What are we going to remember this time? This is not the world I know. She's on the Great Plateau. That's the opening. And there's no it's Hyrule Castle so in the background. Back in the past, it's become legend. Your presence here is just as strange to us, Zelda. But if you, like Sonya, have a secret stone and are able to manipulate time, then your story makes sense. Oh, we're going full on time, dude. I can feel your light power within her, as well as my time power. Additionally, I sense that we share a blood connection. <sighs> Zelda really do be the, uh, the most, uh, you know? I see. In any case, Zelda, you had said that you needed to return to your era as soon as you possibly could. Yes. I bet they're wondering why. In my time, something terrible is happening. I need to get back there. But how do I do that? I don't even know how I got here in the first place. <laughs> <laughs> now, Zelda dear. You don't need to solve your problems all at once. Why not come back with us to the castle? Hmm? We'll tell everyone that you're a distant relative of ours. That's so sweet. <laughs> Look at the... It is true, after all. The eye, the Triforce. We'll get you fresh clothes, too. It's like Geoglyphs on his sure skin. I'm sure an answer will come to you. Wisdom takes time. I don't know what to say. Hmm, I wonder. Minoru, she may have some idea of how to get you back to your era. Minoru, you said? Yes. She knows far more than anyone about our people. And like us, my older sister has a secret stone. We'll call on her. Okay. This is very interesting. There's a lot here. So basically, the next one's over here. Uh, and we kind of do want to go to the Elden Region anyways, because that's where our next quest is. Well, we'll check it out, you know? Is this, is this, wait, is this what I think it is? Oh my God. Wait, they put, chat. They put your mom into the game. I can't, your mom's here. Wow, what a cameo. Uh, this seems intense. Okay, I need to go, it's a, it's called a battle talus. Okay, I'm gonna go off here. I'm actually gonna climb up and around and then onto the talus, I think. Okay, nice. <laughs> Okay. Uh, I think it's important to get probably as many. Uh, okay. 
All right, let me see if I can climb this properly. I need to get out. Oh, I, I don't know if I can. Oh, okay. So I need to find a different way to get up, I think. Wait, I, I can get up. Can I, can I use... Can I use Ascend to get up? I totally can. Okay, nice. All right, and the Battle Talus is gone. Nice. Wow, we got a lot of Amber and everything. Whoa, 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 wait, one second. What is this? The heart? Can I fuse the heart with like... <laughs> Damn, a Stone Talus hammer. That's actually amazing. I'm trying to see, where was that... Oh, it's over here. Okay. All right. Let's find out where this tier is. I found it already. Here we go. It is quite an interesting device. This is definitely not from this era. That said, I believe there may be a way to that get the be functionality working here. I'd like to tinker with it a bit. Would it be okay if I borrow it? Yes. All right. Zelda's Whatever changed into need, what we see her now really as. really appreciate your help. Then I'll hold on to it. Minoru, do you know of a way we could help to return Zelda back to her time? Yeah, she I also has. It a was the power ear. of your secret stone that allowed you to travel through time. To put it simply, secret stones amplify the power their owners possess. Oh, okay. I am able to separate my spirit from my body. What? Raru can repel or destroy evil with his power of light. Interesting. And Sonia, she can control time. Those are insane As powers. For you, I can sense both light and time powers. That's insane. But your secret stone seems to amplify your time power. Time that's power. that's why it was so difficult for Zelda to activate her light secret in Breath of the Wild. Amplifies your power. That makes sense. It doesn't suddenly grant you mastery and control. That's still up to you. Oh. That means. If you don't already know how to get yourself home. Oh, she might not be able to get back home. But we've seen there her now are in the present. about the secret stones and a forbidden act called draconification. What? To swallow a secret stone is to become an immortal dragon, one blessed with eternal life. You can become a dragon by swallowing your stone? Another way to reach the future, though not a very quick one. So you think these stories could hint at a solution to our dilemma? Yes. But there is still what? more to those tales. What is this lore, dude? To become an immortal dragon is to lose oneself. That is why it is forbidden. Oh, so you become a, a I thought creature, maybe this but... could lead to a solution. Some way to transcend time. But if you have to sacrifice your heart and mind, sacrifice what makes you, you. And that's not worth I'm it. I'm sorry. I wish I could help more. Dude, that's crazy. Uh, Is that back where we started? There's still hope. I think the answer, the answer to this problem lies in study and learning more about the nature of your power. I'm sure Sonya would be happy to help you. <laughs> She's very oh my god, that's so cool too. <sighs> Okay. We just learned about draconification. That's actually incredibly interesting. The cool thing that we learned there too is that, I mean, Zelda has light and time powers, but she struggles to control her light powers because, I mean, the secret stone amplifies her time ones. Hence why it was so difficult for her to repel Ganon during the events of Breath of the Wild. Wow. We just learned a lot with that. That's crazy, dude. <laughs> Let's go get the uh, tower here. Okay, here we go. Whoa, what happened here? The tower is not working? Like what a, yeah, the thing blew off. Uh, so why isn't the tower working? A big chunk of old ruins fell from the sky and hit the Skyview Tower. I mean, the hole at the top is open. That's not... Oh, after the impact, the door got stuck too. Let's see. If you use the terminal inside, that would force the door back open. I have an idea. <laughs> we can rewind this and then go up. Oh my God. Yes. All right, we'll rock to the top here. All right. Maybe we can like access it from the inside. Nice. All right, we got it. Oh, in a huge region. There's no lava. The lava's all been drained. So the next memory should be down over this way. Okay, we're looking for a weird alligator. Oh my God, I found the weird, hey. I found the weird alligator. Now we got to find where the tier is. This one's a larger geoglyph. Nice, okay, we found it it's right here. Let's get the third memory. Ah, uh, hi Ganondorf. 
Oh, ho, 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 ho. <gasps> That's the great plateau. Hello. He looks so evil. Hyrule will bow down before me. <laughs> what is that? Moldugas? It's more than okay. we thought. It's a swarm. Attacking the Hylians. There are so many of them. But why would they? Yeah, they realize that's not a that's a coordinated attack. Basically, the power of the Triforce here. Yoy! God damn! Yo, bro, leaves at least a corpse. That blast wiped out all the Molduga. How is that possible? <sighs> so brute force will not be enough. Okay. Brute force is enough. Is he gonna like try to get on the inside? The secret stone of the Zona. Yeah, that's why. <laughs> How interesting. All right, so we see Ganondorf here, and that's what we saw at the very beginning of the game of the mural, plotting to take a tear from one of the Zonai, which can amplify whatever power he has, which is, as I'm assuming is like the darkness. That is insane. What a cool action sequence. Dude, I am so curious what all of this is. I think we'll explore like a little bit and then maybe we'll go to Elden. All right, let's actually like do a tower real fast. The Poplar Foothills a Sky View Tower. All right, let's do it. You are clear for takeoff. Wow, huge region. Like Hylia, Farron Gra- Oh, I wonder what Farron looks like with the Zonai ruins in Farron. Oh, that giant blotch over the map is where the Zonai ruins are. <laughs> Definitely something good to know. What is that over there? Oh, <gasps> is that a great fairy? Oh my God. Hello. Um, okay. The great fairy Mija. Away with you. I don't want anything to do with a world ruined by gloom and ruled by monsters. It's cramped in my flower bud, but better than out there. I'll keep my blessing of clothing enhancement to myself. Till I hear the sound of a horn bringing some lively music into the world. I'll never go outside again. Some people deserve to stay down on holes. A French horn player is one of them. Oh my God. Okay. Okay. Is it, is it the French horn guy? <laughs> the one I left for dead. Let's take out regret and go to the French horn guy. Saving Zelda and Hyrule. Whoa, 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 whoa. Hey, we gotta go uh, talk to a guy with a French horn. Yeah, okay. So French horn dude is over here. All right, my guy. Seems like you've gotten yourself stuck in a uh, in a ditch. Oh, oh, hey, did you come down to rescue me? I haven't figured out how to get both me and my wagon out of this hole and I won't leave it behind. So I need to build something here. I feel as if though, this is a really easy solution. There we go. Get in the wagon. All right, I'm in the wagon, ready to go. Okay. Onwards, onwards. All right, my guy, you're a little heavy. I'm not gonna lie. Okay, you got some sort of lift. All right, you're out, dude. Oh, 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 Jesus. <laughs> ah, too dangerous. Okay. Hey, when in doubt, just more. Don't worry, I won't kill you this time. Get in the wagon. Okay, okay, here we go. Here we go. Onwards. Yes, we've done it. I'm out of the hole. Yes. Go deliver your French horn to that great fairy, the Hylian Mariachi. So we, we've taken a couple, a uh, little bit of a detour to get a bunch of different memories and everything, but it might be time to go to Elden. Mainly because of that. That right there looks to be a great fairy. So let's let's nab that. There's smoke coming out of the nostrils of the... Yeah, it, that's so weird. Oh, it has teeth too. Why is the woodland stable the way it is? All right, let's go check out that fairy fountain. Great fairy Terra. I know what you are, monster. 
You've come for my blessing of clothing enhancement. I've heard this land is now smothered in gloom and overrun by monsters. Until I hear a violin played by a musician and troop, I can't bear the thought of ever going outside ever again. Right here. Yo, we have a vi violin player. Our beloved Breezer. Some of its wheels broke, and now we can't even transport our instruments to perform. So in order to get the violinist to the Great Fairy, we need to fix their cart. So uh, the way we do this, Zonai devices, we got a couple wheels here. <laughs> they might be a little heavy duty for this, but I think it might work. God! Damn, dude! Dude, this thing is a monster, my guys. It's actually working. It's actually, this is so stupid. Uh, wait, 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 wait. I need to bring you. You know what? No, we're gonna walk. Uh, I'm not feeling well after that. I can't do this anymore. You don't like the monster cart, dude? All right. We'll do it the boring way. All right, let's go. Very nice. Thank you. We can take it from here. It's pretty. I like it. Hi, Tara. I couldn't resist coming out uh, to bask in your beautiful music. Now that I'm outside, I see how the world is not at all what Princess Zelda has described it to me. Oh? She warned me that an awful gloom was spreading over the land and that the world would soon be lost to monsters. I hid myself away. Mm. Now that I look back on it, while Princess Zelda was speaking to me, I would feel like something wasn't right. In the deep dark of the night, I couldn't see her face clearly. Maybe it was someone else entirely. Zelda does sound possessed. She looked like Princess Zelda, but wasn't Princess Zelda. You'll find my sisters in their flower buds. They're as scared as I was to come out of hiding. Mija is near the stable in Habra. Okay, so, that, okay, we know Mija. Uh, there's also uh, Kaisa in Hyrule Field. And then uh, Kotera in uh, West Nukluda. Bye! Bye! Oh, and by the way, if you like the video, feel free to subscribe. It helps the channel out a lot. All right, let's do the Elden main quest. Oh, what's this say? What's this up here? So we are going towards uh, Unobo Co., is hiring okay so you know Bo, the champion from breath of the wild uh, has a whole mining corp i wonder how our man's is doing it seems like the volcano has stopped erupting so there's not much lava around yeah it's a tomahawk shrine against the flow oh we can just recall this can't we oh and it's we're actually oh okay um okay all right I made it. I made it. I, I barely made it. We're good. Everything's fine. I think I know what to do here, but I don't think you guys are going to like it. When in doubt, build a bridge. This is so dumb. This is totally not what you're supposed to do. I have no idea what you are, but I did it regardless, and I, it, it's amazing. It worked. God damn it. Hear me out. What happens when I put a minecart and use it? That's... This is so stupid. What? What? what is this is. I block you now with my minecart. Near all of me, like you know. Are you kidding me? That's so cool. You can rail grind. Yeah, dude. What? Everyone's like addicted to eating this meat. This marbled rock roast is mine, 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 all mine. Nobody gets a single bite. If you want some of your own, head to Goron City. It's up this path. After the marbled rock rose started surfacing, everyone's acting strange. Mm. Dude, I wonder if like the gloom from Ganon got inside of their food storage and now is like when they eat it, it like affects their brain chemistry. That's what I'm thinking here. Oh my God. What's Jesus? There's nothing else I need. Tastier than diamonds. Oh, they are totally addicted. Oh my God. The regional phenomenon that's happening in Goron City is drugs. You all talking about marble rock roast, are ya? He's like a luchador. <laughs> they turn Unobo into a drug lord. What could you want? <laughs> what is this story? What's your business in Goron City, huh? I actually love this so much. Princess Zelda, huh? Are you worried about any strange goings-ons? Mm -hmm. Princess Zelda? I heard she got missing, but you're telling me she's still missing? I mean, it's hard to miss those lovely blonde locks of hers, after all. Okay. A little weird. <laughs> She's the same one President Yobo talks to about Marble Rock Roast. Whoa, 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 whoa. Okay, so we're kind of uncovering here that the Princess Zelda that we're seeing around Hyrule is like possessed in some way, and she's the one who told Yunobo about the Marble Rock Roast to get everybody addicted to it, turning Yunobo into a drug lord. What? What's happening? Or is it like an imposter Zelda? I gotta get more drugs. <laughs> I can't afford to keep her waiting. Slurgo off rack. Time to head to Unobo Co HQ. Dude, there's some weird goings on here. Can you just like rail grind down here? 
<laughs> it's so amazing. Osha's not uh, here, so we can do whatever we want. Uh, yes, he's talking about marbled rock roast with the blonde lady right now. Oh, oh. Uh, Yunobo said he got that weird mask he's wearing from the lady too. He's always so nice, but as soon as he started wearing it, he got real mean. Oh, this is like Majora's mask kind of like style. Oh, Yunobo's talking to the blonde lady here. Oh, there's Zelda. And that's where he's getting the marbled rock roast. Uh... Cut it out already, President Yunobo. Oh my, <laughs> I'm a little hot right now. We want you to take off that weird mask so you can go back to the President Yunobo we low and love. Oh. Boys. Huh? Uh, what is Zelda doing to him? Oh, God. Huh. Princess Zelda is right. Marbled rock roast is good. Oh, we're fighting you, Nobo? Jeez. Oh, I can't actually hurt him. If I can't hurt him, how do I do this? Oh, oh, he's dizzy. He's dizzy. Okay. Whoa. Oh, okay, we're breaking the mask. Okay, so we need him to, to knock into um some sort of, like, wall. Okay, perfect. And then we hit him. Okay. Oh, the, the mask is almost broken. Nice. I got him. Perfect. What happened? Oh, no, that's so cute. Slurgo, Offrak, I don't understand. Everything's a blur since I put on the mask from Princess Zelda. I need to talk to her. Ah, uh, Princess Zelda. What is happening? Why is why is Zelda doing this? She has to be possessed or something. Oh, we got a cave in. So we can't follow her. Uh, everyone all right? No one's injured? Oh, so the mask went away, but also said the leopard print cape. He's now back to the miner rather than the uh, the drug lord. Okay, cool. The only way to break those red rocks is with my charge attack. Okay, so we're learning Yunobo's skill here. All right, Yunobo's power of fire. Okay, so here let's I go. go. And then charge. Oh, and we can also use uh, Tulin as well still. Wow. Okay. Let's use Yunobo. That's so cool. I like that a lot. So we need to go to the top of Death Mountain because we're just trying to find out what the hell is happening with the gloom around these parts. Wait. Okay. This is going to sound stupid. What if we like, do like two more? <laughs> Here I go. So we can shoot from the minecart? Huh? Okay. That's kind of cool. So if we need to shoot from the minecart, we can. Dude, we're getting this power. Oh, we're going like vertical. I'm glad I added like four fans to this. So we're trying to go on top. So in order to do that, we need to go around here. Oh my God, we're going to be taking... We're literally going to be taking a minecart all the way up. There's a bunch of gliders too here. Yeah, they've been building it. Wait, what is this? They've been building a lot. Is this a rocket? Oh my God. Hear me the goddamn out, okay? Jesus, oh my God. I can't believe that worked. <laughs> Oh wait, let me turn let me turn these off. We don't waste our batteries. Okay. Hey, remember guys. All right, save the environment. Use your rockets like occasionally. Okay, I'll take it. Oh, uh, we're out of juice. All right, I'll use my personal juice then. <laughs> I should maybe rephrase that. Um, I, I'll use I'll use. Uh, you know what? I'll stand by it. I'll use my personal juice. Whoa, we got some gloom here, and at the end of the line. I think it was near here. This when is where I you saw Zelda? The mountain, I saw her. The princess was standing right here, Goro. And then she gave me this fancy mask to wear around. Hey, you after look sick, that, though. I'm not going to lie. I can't remember anything that happened after that. Ooh. Oh, Zelda's going to the... There she is! Princess! Princess Zelda! <laughs> what what is going it's on? Dangerous. <laughs> Oh my god! She made the mountain explode! What is that? Moragia! Is that marbled rock? Is it alive? And there's three of those things? Hang on. No, no those are heads. Can I can I use this? But yeah, let's figure out this glider. And then I can control it. I can do it! Oh, okay. Okay. We're gonna be in trouble. This is the worst! And yeah, that works. Nice! Okay, got one of them. Okay, that works. Okay, nice. Okay, we got one left. Oh, God. I'm going to heal. Uh, just because, I mean, I don't need to. But, uh, you know, I like how even the uh, hearts look when they're full. See? I didn't get hit. Ooh, we got it. Okay, we got all three. That was so cool. Whoa. 
Oh my god, dude. We we did it? We did it! What was that thing anyways? I thought Princess Zelda walked off somewhere around here. Whoa, you don't suppose she fell into that hole, do you? That would be awful. Come on, Link, let's hurry down there. All right. What the hell is all of this? Oh, we are, we are deep, deep down. Is that a structure? Also, what the hell is that? Hey, double cheeked up on a Saturday afternoon, am I right? They're producing some marbled meat roasts out here, but that man's right there. That man's is producing some genuine A5 cake. How would Princess Zelda be down here with all the marbled rock roast? Oh, there's that voice again. I'm hearing things again. But I mean, you heard that too, right, Link? Maybe this has to do with Zelda. Yep. Dude, I don't think... I don't think Zelda's who you think she is. All right, well, I guess we're supposed to go over this way. There we go. All right, what's behind here? Like, what is this place that he saw? What the... What the hell? All right, I want to get this light thing first, though. So we can always come back here. That's a gloom boss bacoblin. And no, I didn't, I didn't want to live anyways. Okay, this works. Great, great. Oh, Lordy. So far, so good, right? What is... Huh? Um... Uh, yeah, I'll just take this sword. What are you? A soldier's broadsword. It's not decayed. It's a regular soldier's broadsword. Let me give it my best material here. Whoa, dude. Okay, that's actually really cool. The Fire Temple. Lost Gordania rediscovered. So this is the ancient civilization of the Gorons that we're discovering here. All right, let's go do the Fire Temple. Whoa, dude. Look at this map. Oh, there's a first floor, second floor, third floor, fourth floor, and fifth floor. Oh, it's a vertical dungeon. Okay, let's see if I can like big brain this dungeon like I did the last one. Okay, here we go. What is this place? And why is there something like this inside Death Mountain? Huh? Huh? Hi, Zelda. <laughs> Wait, Gora, I gotta talk to you. I don't think that's Zelda, dude. What the? Where did she go? All right, let's enter the fire temple. What is this? There's something up ahead. Huh? It's Zelda, Gora. What? Uh, um, um. That looks like the sack that Calamity Ganon was in in Breath of the Wild. Not good, not good. Princess Zelda's stuck inside there. We gotta hurry and help her. Well, I think she wants to be in there, man. I think she's trying to like be reborn or something. Right, okay. Young little rock, the gate you must pass through is firmly locked with five padlocks. There's all five. Okay. My words. Uh, all we gotta do is unlock the five locks and then we can get in there. So let's go try this one over here. It seems like we can probably end up doing a uh, first floor. Oh, also, <laughs> it's funny. It's so hot. It says error for temperature. Okay, okay, okay. So ultra hand. Uh, and we can use these. So it's gonna solidify the rock in the water. So we can do this. Do it again. All right, attach. Oh my God. You guys are gonna hate me for this. When in doubt, make a bridge. There we go. <laughs> we did it. Yay. Uh, what is this? Whoa. Okay, so we're gonna do some like weird like railway magic here, I guess. So if we do this, here I, go. I can hit this while we're moving. And I, I order for us to go straight. That's really cool. All right, so this should be the first one. Seems a lot of it is around the creation of those stones. When in doubt, become a bridge boy. Here I go. And now I can uh, charge you across. Awesome. Oh, Link, check this out. Yeah, so that's the first thing. It's like a gong. It seems like if you hit it, Yunobo, uh, it unlocks one of the locks for the bridge. That's so cool. Oh, it's like it's like its ears go up, like it's listening. Pretty neat. That must be the first padlock, Link. One more. Oh, there are four more for us to find. That's a lot. Okay, Yunobo. Looks like uh, he has not stopped with the whining. Some things never change. All right, let's go. I can do it. You can do it. All right, let's do the second puzzle for the second terminal, looks like. I missed. <laughs> really like here. Nice. All right, there we go. All right, so that should create a couple platforms here. I think recall is the way to go for these things. All right, because they'll go back, and then we can, like, use this as a bridge. Look at this. Go. And then we're on to the second gong already. I'm solving this fast, dude. All right, three more left. So we've already done this. We're second floor. Third floor does lead to this one right here. So let's go back third floor. Okay, hello. How's it going? Nice. 
Can I, like, jump minecarts? Oh, I totally can jump minecarts. Okay, perfect. Oh, that was sick. Okay, and then how do I get off this thing? I actually... Wait, okay. You good, you nobo? Is this... I don't know if the game's okay right now. Dude, how do I keep breaking this game? He, like, teleported that way. Is he gone forever? Oh, there he is. Why did it take so long for him to spawn back? Oh, it's because Yunobo stayed on the cart that I jumped off on. So if you keep changing carts, Yunobo will stay on the cart that you originally were at. Huh, I'll probably climb up here though. Oh my God, I'm not thinking about Ascend. What am I doing? It's a vertical dungeon. So why wouldn't you use Ascend? I'm figuring it out. Okay, so we are currently on the third floor of the Fire Temple. Hello. Jesus. Wait, this is, this is like a, a, a new construct. We have not found this yet. Zonite charge, Zonite. This is a Captain Construct two horn. Okay. We got rockets! I love this. So we need to go somehow bridge the gap over here and then do that. We did just get rockets. I wonder if you can like take the rocket and you fuse it with your shield. You can just go up. Here we go. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I think I'll do that. And here we go. I actually really like that solution. Let's see what else is over this way. Oh, All right, I'm gonna take one of these. Maybe, I have an idea. If I put a time bomb and then it floats up and hits the time bomb. Here we go. <laughs> oh! Also, wait, no, the bomb's not gonna work. It needs to be Yunobu that does this, doesn't it? Oh my God, wait. Uh, You could, when you are, you could do anything. Oh, I'm, I, Okay, that was by far the stupidest death that I've ever had in Tears of the Kingdom so far. I died to a torch. Maybe I make like a ramp and then Yunobo goes up for the shot. I can do it, charge. Yeah, that's totally it. Oh, it did work. Jesus. I don't know what I use this for yet. However, if I want to get up there fast, let me out. Meow. Hey, we did it. <laughs> oh, let's go. Let's go. Cool solution. Just two left, Link. All right, almost done. Let's go over here and explore the rest of this small hub area. Okay, we haven't been here yet. So it looks like for this gong, we just do a ramp here. Sure. It gives me a fire hydrant. I mean, really good to know about uh, fire hydrants. They make excellent bridges. <laughs> no, I will not be taking questions at this time. Okay, that might be good enough. Nice. Okay. It definitely is. Nice. Okay. One left and it is uh, this one right here. Oh, I feel like we did the same thing. Make a little bridge. Take this and we bring it to our already built bridge. Attach it. <laughs> Maybe I built it a little bit too big. And I take this and put it right there. Okay. That works. Let's go. <laughs> no, 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 no. no. <gasps> <sighs> Give me a second. Use recall. Guys, you can't use recall to undo every mistake you made. If so, you guys would have never been born. And there we go. Oh, it's like hanging on by a thread. How did that just manage to... All right, we did it anyways. I think we go down this way for the for the gong now. Come on, Yunobo. Let's go hit this gong for the last lock on that bridge. All right, let's go do it. The dungeon design in Tears of the Kingdom is actually phenomenal. So I have only four hearts right now. And I can like probably like leave the dungeon and come back and heal up those hearts, have it so I don't have any like gloom. Or I just go into the battle with four hearts and send it. Here we go. Right to the boss. We gotta smash those red rocks to rescue Zelda. It's not rescuing, man. It's not rescuing. Here we go. Giant arena. Yeah, I think I send you up the side and you can, yeah, go up like that. That's really, really big. What is this thing? Okay. Okay. Is Zelda inside the monster? Oh, God. Look at that design, dude. Marbled Goma. It's Goma. Goma's back. What's happening is that like all these bosses are, are bosses from like past Zelda games. So if we're far enough away, he'll shoot out his things. Can I recall on these? I totally can. Oh yeah. But I need to do it, I think right at the explosion mark. This is a really cool boss. Here we go. Oh, what? Oh, oh, it worked, it worked, it worked. 
Okay, I can hit it like that now. No, I don't think I do damage like that with arrows. I think I actually have to use recall here. If I just did it immediately. Nice, I think. I think I can get on him now. Yeah, I can. Oh, let me use the black moblin hammer. Okay, all right, all right, I guess not. Huh? All right, there's something I got to figure out here with this boss fight. Wait, can I use you and then do this again? Like right on top, if you're... Oh! Oh! I see that. That was a total accident, but it worked. So I can use you to get the uh, uh, leg. Yeah, yeah, there it is. Okay, cool. Now's my chance. Oh, I have a pretty good weapon too. Halfway! Oh my God, in one cycle! Whoa, he's on the he's on the ceiling now. Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, he is on the ceiling right now. Nice, that did work. Okay, perfect. Oh, that was huge. Oh, so close. He's like two hits away. All right, he's back on the ceiling. All right, let me do that. Did I hit him? I hit him, I hit him. Two more hits. Oh, there's three more. We did it! Yes! Oh, that was such a cool boss fight, man. That was so fun. It's actually so cool. So Goma is from Ocarina of Time, right? Polgara from the Wind Temple is from Wind Waker. So whoever Zelda is in this is like bringing back old bosses. Wow, dude. Let's get the uh, the heart container. Nice. We have six hearts now. Seven hearts now. I lied. Let's talk to Yunobo. Let's see what the voice from the tier is. I think we're going to get the, the fire sage here. <laughs> wow, dude. Are you the one Whoa. who's been talking to us this whole time? Whoa, that's so pretty. Yes. Damn. I am your ancestor from a time long past. His Zonai mask is shaped like Varudania as well. I served the first king of Hyrule as a mighty warrior. Like the Var like Varudania was modeled after the Zonai mask fire. here. You defeated that monster, the source of those foul rocks. But it was the demon king who summoned it. So the demon king in Zelda's you flesh? That monster to keep you from obtaining the stone you just found. My secret stone. The Demon King is possessing Zelda, it seems like. The magic restraining the Demon King will be undone. I'd like nothing more than to smash the Demon King. <laughs> I swear. You and my chat when both. the Demon King returns, the Sage of Fire will <laughs> awaken again. Take up my secret stone and honor the pledge I made to the Sage of Time long ago. Fight alongside the swordsman. Link. I can do this. Yeah. There it is. Yeah, he's got courage now. I am the Sage of Fire. I've got an awesome new power, Goro. Oh, the music. Oh, wow, dude. Yeah. So now we can use Yunobo's power anywhere. Link, hold out your fist. Hmm. Whoa. <laughs> that's what it, that's you literally what they're doing. The sage of fire. I'll fight by your side till the very end. Hell yeah. And take this. It's proof I stand with you. All right, we got the pinky, and now we got the thumb. Slowly collecting all of our infinity rocks. Okay, let's head back. Nice. Seems like the Demon King was manipulating Zelda's body or something in order to revive Goma and create all of these uh, addictive gloom meat. And they're all back. <laughs> yeah. We're back to normal. Goron Village seems to be all proper and functioning. And we got the Vow of Unobo Sage of Fire. So we can now get the Avatar of Unobo with us. Not bad. All right. If we look at the map here. Wow. We've actually completed a decent chunk of stuff today. We finished uh, pretty much uh, the Elden region. I think tomorrow we're going to go to the depths. We're going to explore all of this. Okay. Let's go down the... I'm going to call it this. Let's go down the Gussy. It's the Gloom... Oh my god. Oh my god, dude. Oh, 
Look at that. that. Dude, that's so creepy, dude. I mean, let's aim towards this light route right here. The hell are you? That's fine. It's not creepy at all. Don't worry. Ooh, a soldier's broadsword. What's our best uh, thing here? Oh, a diamond. <laughs> oh, damn. Oh, damn. That is a cool weapon. Hello? Oh, you know what? It looks like all of the soldier ghosts have like genuine weapons because around like the surface, when like Ganon shot up Gloom, all of the weapons across Hyrule like rusted, but it looks like not really in the depths as much. All right, we're, we're trying to go this way over here. Yeah, 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 this is what we want to look at. This light route over here. I just wonder if there's like, there has to be some like secrets down here. I mean, come on, you wouldn't like create something like... Can I? Oh, yes! That makes exploration so much easier. Friend! What do we name him? Denial? <laughs> we'll go with Denial. All right, nice. We got another light route here. Whoa. Yeah, let's try to unlock more of the map here. Wait, can I... Okay, question. Can I, like, run over Gloom with... You can. Okay, so if you're on a horse, you can run over Gloom, and it won't affect you. It's Noyuk Light Route. Wait, is this the same name as the... No, Kiona Shrine. Oh my god! It's reversed! Sinoyuk is the reverse of Kionis. That's insane! Wow, that one that one really Oh? <laughs> this is underneath Hyrule. Yeah, we gotta take a, a look here. Whoa. What's down here? Gustav Canyon Mine. Oh, and it really looks like yeah, yeah, look at this. Yeah, there's some legitimate <laughs> Zonai ruins here. Alright, let's keep going this way over here. Hey, how's it going? Fancy seeing you here. I keep missing. Keep missing. Here we go. Uh, let me spin to win this. Uh, I think that's the way to go. Yeah, dude, I love how double hits still work too. Oh my God. Nice. There we go. There we go. And we got the stall locks. Not too bad. Oh, and we got a new, we got a stall lock. 29 fuse attack power. That's, that's pretty good. It's a 36 damage sword. Ew. Ew. Oh, oh, it has skulls on it. The Bokoblin skulls. Oh, that's so cool. And I hate it. And it's so creepy. What the hell? It keeps going down. Daphnis Canyon Mine. Oh, this is creepy. No, this is this is a little creepy. Yeah. I need, I need more Bright Bloom soon. Oh, there's probably something over this way. With a miner's top? A shirt featuring lamps of various sizes. Oh, we can glow now. Oh, that's so cool. We've explored a lot here. I think we should probably go on the overworld, explore and get some more shrines here. So then we can like know where the light routes are. All right, Hyrule Field, Skyview Tower. All right, so that's uh, Hyrule Field. Okay, and we got some new Sky Islands here too. Yeah, let's just like land it right here. I said land it. Um, oh, oh, I did land it. Oh my God. There's a gotcha ball. Some gambles. <laughs> Wait, I was stupid. Oh, it didn't attach properly. Uh, 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 uh I, I did it. Uh, explosive. Let's check out the Great Plateau. Oh my God. This is at every shrine on the Great Plateau. The, this this gloom here. Oh, we got to check it out. Let's see what this Great Plateau looks like. The Great Plateau in Hyrule Field. It's the opening cutscene, dude, for Breath of the Wild. It's so weird to like say this, I guess, but like this it feels nostalgic. <laughs> All right, let's go check out the Shrine of Resurrection. Here's the actual shrines. Oh. It's a, it's a little bath. Okay, okay. That's actually kind of a neat detail. We're healing from... Uh, oh? Oh? Why does this seem... Yiga clan? <laughs> yeah, it's... Yep, you fell for the oldest trick in the book. <laughs> for the record, I called it out that it was a trap. I can't let you live. Your life ends today. Oh, okay. You're just right here. We, we did it! Yay! Authorizer verified. 
Hello? Thank you for driving away the intruders. The interlopers carried me here with them from the depths. My task in the depths was to manage schema stones. I have something for you, but I do not think you are ready to receive it. Please visit the great abandoned central mine in the depths and return here after. Okay, sure. So we need to go back underneath to the depths, which was the goal all along after we do the Great Plateau and stuff. Yeah, this is so cool to see. But what happened to the shrines? So this is where the Magnesis Shrine used to be. Now it's just sunk into the bottom. Here we go. Let's go into the chasm. Oh, there's, there's a lot of ruins over there. Well, let's make a, an all-terrain vehicle. I'm really good at building in this game. <laughs> look at the lights. <laughs> totally. You can totally see right in front of you. <laughs> oh, wow. Look, it's a light route. Exactly like I thought would be here. Onwards. <laughs> this is the stupidest thing. <laughs> Jesus Christ. <laughs> oh, God. Okay, we're walking. Oh, well, oh, yeah, up here. There's a guy down here already? What's going on, guys? Ah, I didn't think we'd see anyone else down here. You're here to investigate too, right? You know, since uh, you took the ye, I mean, you have the survey team interview. Okay. On this weird device with these wavering green letters on it and this strange statue. We think it's one of those living stone constructs. Authorizer verified. Oh, it's moving. Yeah, hello. Conferring auto build to authorizer now. Are we getting a new power? What? Instantly recreate your ultra hand projects using nearby items in Zoanite. As luck would have it, both of our vehicles just broke and we've been struggling to put them back together again. Okay, don't, don't. <laughs> Look at that. Well, that wheel's back on there, snug as a bug. Yep, in exactly the place it's supposed to be. So it costs six. Oh, whoa. As, as, as whoa. It has like a radius. And as you have the, the parts, it adds them together. That's so cool. I'll say that power is incredible. Oh, master. What? Uh, eyes. Yeah. Look at that. The legends were true. Oh my God. It's Koga. Hello. Great work, both of you. What? There's one foe I'll never forget. It's the man who cast me from my Gerudo Desert hideout into these very depths. It was you. Oh, oh. In Breath of the Wild, when you defeat Master Koga, you put him down into the hole and then you cast him down to the depths. Now I live for vengeance, both upon that no good Zelda and upon my sworn enemy. That means you, Link. Hear my name and tremble in fear. I am the leader of the Yiga clan. The strong, the depths defying, from the ashes rising. Master Koga! I saw the moment you attained the ancient power we've sought for so long. You know who could have used that power? The one we worship and revere, the Magnificent One. Who's the Magnificent One? So you walked up right and snatched it away. Now I'm going to snatch back. Here we go. Prepare yourself. Yeah. Oh, the oh, this is so cool. No, no, come back here. Come back here. Come back here. Oh, yes. Hello. <laughs> Wait, can I drive it? <laughs> oh, okay. Uh, here we go. You knocked yourself and we're back. We did it. I saw your little trick there. You used your right hand to get that construct going. I'll grab that power you cheated me out for myself off at the Southwestern abandoned mine. <laughs> then the magnificent one and I will guide the world to its miserable end. Oh my God. Oh, so you can do the same thing. So don't follow me. Dude, Koga is so fun. So we need to follow these statues. Looks like you go to the Gerudo mine. Interesting. Miner's trousers. Yes, we got the second set. Oh my God, we look so cool right now. Oh my God, it keeps going deeper. Why does this keep going deeper? It's actually like, I, I'm i actually kind of scared. I'm not going to lie. I don't do well with like scary things. Oh, did you hear that? You guys heard that, right? It was like a weird screech. No? You guys heard that, right? Do you see it? Right there, right? You heard it, you heard it. Okay, maybe this is Subnautica. Tulgara! The Scourge of the Depths! I'm so sorry, I didn't mean to talk to- Oh my god! Go, 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 go! I think he's out here. Oh, there's Tulgara! Oh my god! Tulgara's up there. Here we go. Got one, okay. I got one, I got one. It's the same boss fight as the Wind Temple. Take that, Colgate! That's right! Damn! 
Dude, that freaked me out. I didn't think there was a full boss fight underground here. Okay, I'm going to take this eightfold blade katana and fuse with the Colgara jaw. <laughs> Damn! Oh my god! What do we get as a reward for defeating it? 100 uh, crystallized charges. Okay, nice. I think Eric's lost. I'm not lost. I know exactly where I'm going. I want to go here. I just don't know how to get there. What the? Huh? Why is there a dragon here? Uh, and there's something over frogs. Okay, so that can do that. Can I get, oh, can I like climb up him? All right, so I climb up him. In order to beat him, I can do like this. Oh, okay. So you have to do that to, to beat him. These things. Okay. And all of them too. So much damage. Oh, okay. Yeah, that's the way to go. Yeah, the flex core smasher. Damn! It was no chance. Uh, let's follow more of the statues to Master Koga. Oh, wait, this is where the Yiga clan is. This is where we're supposed to be. The abandoned Gerudo mine. Yes. Where Master Koga said he would be. Hey, what's up, Koga? It's the right hand, right? So why isn't this working? Hey, hey, oh. <laughs> How's it going, Koga? So Link, you just had to follow me here, didn't you? I'm doing what you did exactly, but it refuses to work. You tricked me. I won't stand for this. You wasted some of my time, but no more. I'll battle you. I'll beat you. And I'll steal that power back from you. All right, here we go. Prepare yourself. Oh, 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 you're flying now. All right, how should we do this? Oh, you know what? Literally just key side balls. That's the way to go. Nice. Where'd he go? Where'd he go? Oh my God, bombs from above. Here we go. Oh my God. Yeah, double team. Let's go. Come on, so close. And we got him. Yes. Oh God, this place has too much sand. Anakin Skywalker, is that you? Oh my God. Master Koga was Darth Vader all along. We've been collecting a mighty power source scattered across all the land. Crystallized charges. And we're going to use them to restore an unstoppable weapon for the man himself. The Magnificent One. We've already stripped all the resources here. You want this empty shell? You can have it. When we swim in crystals at the Eastern Abandoned Mine. Now I fly away. Goodbye. The Eastern Abandoned Mine uh, that the man spoke of is most likely the abandoned Lineru Mine. It's extremely far from here. Okay. We need to go that year later. The abandoned Kara Kara Mine. Underneath Kara Kara Bazaar. We got the Miner's Mask. Do we have the full set now? That's such a cool set. Yeah, there's no way. It's in this place, in this time, that I, I think to myself, maybe we've been in the depths too far. Yeah, uh, maybe we go to the Hyrule Field uh, Skyview Tower. Yeah, let's try that. I was a frame away from dying. Back to the Shrine of Resurrection. Let's go talk to that construct who said they had something for us. I uh, confirmed that, you, uh, that there's a schema stone you not have. Oh, that's what it is. They're going to give me a schema stone. And it is for a beam cycle? What the hell is a beam cycle? All right, let's check out the Temple of Time. The Temple of Time ruins. And this is where you get the paraglider from King Rome Boss Rama's Hyrule at the end of the tutorial in Breath of the Wild. They give you the nostalgic fabric, which is the design of the paraglider for Breath of the Wild. Oh my God. That's such a cool detail. It's the goddess statue. I am trapped under the water behind the stone gate of the Great Plateau. Trapped in the water by the stone gate. Oh, all right. Is this it? Oh, it was it. We just let out all of the water. You who hear my voice. Come to me in the Temple of Time Ruins. As a result of you draining the water from the gate, a part of me has been freed. You've earned my gratitude. I speak to you now from the depths below in guise of the statue. Oh? The four shrines. I direct you to the four chasms across the plateau. Each has one of my eyes nearby. Drop them into the chasms. Then deliver the stones to me, who dwells in the depths below this temple. Do all of this, and the reward will be yours. We need to go to each one of these. Um, is it here? Oh, it is. What is, oh, uh, what is this? Okay. And then you throw it in there. Okay, I threw the eye in the chasm. Nice, let's do the next one then. Oh, oh is the Korok with the backpack? He needs to reach his friend. My friend and I got separated. 
Where is he? Uh, he's pretty far. Uh, good luck. Oh, here's the other uh, eye. Second eye. So here's the next one. Ta-da! We did it! Okay, stasis should be right over here. Aha! Cool. You have now thrown all four eyes into the chasms. All that remains is to carry them through the depths. Oh, wait, they're gonna they're down there? Oh god. So now we have to carry these eyes to the voice. Which is like here. What the hell is this? One of the eyes. You have returned one of my eyes to me this far. After you found my eyes on the plateau above, each of them near a chasm, bringing every last one of them here to me. This is so cool and also so scary. The last eye. You have returned me to my eyes, the vessels of my spirit. As promised, I will pay your kindness by bestowing good fortune upon you. Oh, we just get a free heart container. That's pretty good. That's, I'll take a heart container. <laughs> You who revived my spirit's four vessels, make an offering. Offer pose to me. Spirits that ought to be returned to the afterlife. My brother and I have combined our power to create the tunic of the depths. A tunic acquired by offering pose to a strange statue found in the depths. Whoa! We look so badass. Dude, I'm a plague doctor. So if we find more pose, we can buy more of the uh, gloom resistance set. The tunic of the depths. Damn. All right, that was really cool. Whee! But we're going to stand a little bit and play. Let's go do the batteries. This is a crystal refinery. To produce four energy wells, I require 400 crystallized charges. Dude, yes. Uh, which increases the maximum energy can be used in your energy cell. Damn. You know what I want to do next? We have seven more memories. I want to do them in order. So the next one's over here. And in order to do the next one, we have to start the Gerudo quest here. All right, the Gerudo Canyon Pass. Yo, who are you? There's been some uh, normal weather beyond this point. Blazing heat during the day, freezing cold at night. So it's unbearably cold right now. Are you kidding? But my drip. All right, so it looks like Gerudo is going through some weird and odd temperature fluctuations. Wait, is this a tumbleweed? Oh, 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 it's a tumbleweed. What is this? Follow the beam to its end and offer the crystal there. Oh, shrine. Okay, that doesn't seem too far. I think we actually do make an ultra hand thing here. This is the lamest vehicle you've ever seen in your life. But there's one with three here. All right. Wait, why is it going the opposite way? Oh, because I'm stupid. You know what? Fuck. We'll send it like this. I'm just going to drive backwards. What could go wrong? So easy. So far, so good. It's just all of the controls are inverted. That's it's fine, right? Like who needs regular controls? Hey, hey, I'm... everything OK back there? <laughs> oh, we're almost to the shrine here. Nice. And we got it. Oh, it's a blessing. I'm so curious to see what Gerudo looks like. It's just like re-exploring all of these places. It's a weird nostalgia vibe, but then it's also like, it's like they breathed life into the wild, like a breath of the wild, right? But then it's, it's a sad story. So then you cried tears, tears of the kingdom. All right, let's go to the stable right here. Okay, so this stable isn't closed, but there was a uh, stable earlier. Wait, no, this, oh, this stable is closed. Oh, so many arrows. Let's go. Impressive if you came all this way, but the stable has been closed its doors for good. Thanks to the extreme weather, we got very few visitors. And Princess Zelda gave the order that everyone had to stay away from our well. Ha! Huh? We need that water, not to mention the mushrooms that grow inside it. It's only temporary. It'll help, she said. I'll be right back to fix it, she said. And then she completely abandoned us. Yeah, I don't know about that. <laughs> so anyways... If you're looking for a place to rest, I recommend the Car Car Bazaar. Let's go to Gerudo and see what awaits us. What the hell is that? Okay, first off, Car Car Bazaar has um, a lighthouse. There's some um, more monster stuff. All right, I guess we'll have to see. If you're interested in sand seals, then you're in the right place. Am I going to be able to literally like skateboard? Oh my God. Well, we go too fast, actually, I feel like. With our minecart. I think we go literally too fast. But let's go to uh, the shrine here in Car Car Bazaar. My -ta 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 shrine. A sliding device. Um. Oh, whoa. You probably use recall. That's what I would do if I were an idiot. But I'm not an idiot. So we're going to build a bridge. Okay. Nice. We got um, Sledrick here. Okay. I think that, that works. <laughs> yes. That's my son, my boy, Sledrick Diggory. All right, 
Why can't we just go to the other side? Oh, so what's happening here is that the uh, uh, sand is moving. Wait, Chad, I have such a good idea. We're going to bring Sledrick with us, guys. Okay, here we go. Sledrick, onwards! Really? Okay, so we need we need more. So we do two now. Oh, oh, it's working! It's slow, but it's working! Sledrick! This is the stupidest thing I've done. We're so close. Sledrick! Okay, I need, I need to go. I need to go. Sledrick! Sledrick, I will remember you. Oh, I can bring you with me. No! Sledrick, where'd you go? I'll miss him. The world will never be the same without him. Kara Kara Bazaar. I sell fashionable choice. Uh, staving off the great heat. Headbands the last I have. Uh, sure, I'll buy it. Yep. Right now, if Gerudo Town looks like this. So before we go to Gerudo Town, um, let's get the next memory. What's the best method to get around there? Or I could do the bomb shield trick. Godspeed! <laughs> See, that works. Here's the geoglyph. We need to figure out where the hell the tier is. You know what? It's probably like pretty high up. That's what I'm thinking. Wow. Okay, this geoglyph is pretty large, but it would be like on a flat surface, right? Oh, it's right here. All right, let's get the uh, next memory here. All right. Allow oh, me whoa. to offer you my deepest apologies. This is in like the ancient castle. On behalf of the Gerudo. It's for taking so long to accept your repeated invitations. It is our desire to be accepted into the protective embrace of your kingdom. To serve it faithfully. Oh, I love that. welcome <laughs> appeal, Ganondorf. I will accept your vow of fealty to the kingdom of Hyrule. Yeah, there's the I secret stones. I understand that a single male is born to the Gerudo every 100 years. Receiving such an appeal from you... A hero to his people and a king by birth. Well, it is truly reassuring. He's eyeing those stones. It is my honor. When your Zonai ancestors first descended upon these lands long, long ago, they must have seemed to be gods. And now you rule as king and have taken a Hyrulean woman as your wife. Uh, your majesty okay. has certainly risen above your admirable lineage. Okay, Ganondorf. Most impressive. It is unfortunate that the noble Zonai no longer grace this world with their presence. <gasps> oh. All except you and your sister, that is. Even if something were to happen to me, both my kingdom and the peace it brings. That's a threat. For generations That's to come. such a threat. Like, oh, what happens to you? Your actions today are appreciated, Ganondorf. I look forward to your future endeavors. You may leave. Your Majesty. <laughs> that sword. Oh. He looks so... Dude! I believe that man's heart holds many dark ambitions. She's seen it firsthand. Just his name. Even that. It gives me pause. I am well aware of his evil nature. For that reason, and others, I want him close. It will be easier to keep an eye on him. Oh, I don't know if that's the... I don't know if that's there the There is way. nothing to worry about. Okay. Oh, no. Okay. Raru's like, yep, nothing to worry about. Don't worry. Everything will be fine. Does everything look fine? I just want to like, does, does this look okay here? Hyrule being in the sky look all right. Oh God, dude. How did like, how did we get from there to here now? And what was Zelda's involvement? Because she's still clearly in the past. All right, yeah. So let's let's go on and get the next memory, which should be literally right next to this. All right, we're looking for that geoglyph. All right, screw it. I think we get the tower. Rudo Highland Skyview Tower. How do I get in? What? How the hell do we get in here? The only thing nearby is a cliff and a cave. We'll give the cave a shot. Okay. 
Bilson's records. We're going to keep a record of my time working Skyview Tower. The cave is bigger than any of us could have imagined. We explored inside by following the water downstream. The cave continued all the way under the Skyview Tower. All right, let's go explore. Let's see what's up. Oh, Lord. Oh, God. Oh, my God. Down the waterfall. Okay, not... That wasn't planned. All right, chat. I'm going to um, sit down. Actually. This is POV. I'm talking to you. And you're short. Okay. Wait, I can explain. This is good, right? Look, I'm sitting again. Okay, here's my stupid idea. These are the bracers for the tower. What if I ascend into the tower? Oh, I can. Okay, let's ascend. Yes. Yes. Oh, it snowed in. Okay, gotcha. And now we can activate the tower. Three, a two, a one. Take off. Lift off. Take off. Take out. There's a giant hole there. Oh. And uh, there's a... Okay. Is that a sphere? Oh my god. The Death Star is here. Oh my god. Yeah. All right. So we're going to do the memory right over here. Here it is. Let's find this tier. Let's watch this next memory. Memory number six. After Ganondorf pledges his allegiance to Hyrule and Raru accepts. Oh, nice cup of tea. <laughs> That's such an unnecessary use of the power, but like, are you well? You seem a kind of badass. Distant. I'm not gonna lie. I apologize. I keep getting lost in my thoughts, thinking about how I can return home with your power over time. If I were able to learn that kind of control, I might be one step closer to my era. I see. The secret is to think of it like drawing out the object's memory. You ask the object where it was, how it arrived where it is now, and then you coax it back to that original moment in time. The object's okay. memory. I'm sure it will become almost like second nature, and you will be able to find your way home. But Zelda... There is more on your mind than just that. I mean, she didn't. <sighs> huh? You, of course, do want to get back to your time. But you also desperately want to help us out in this era. <gasps> Am I close to the truth? How did you know? <laughs> Can't... <laughs> Can you even I do, do both? I do not believe it is possible to keep anything secret from Sonya. <laughs> oh, your concern is very sweet, Zelda. But listen. You can focus your attention on returning home. After all, you possess more than power over time. You have a sacred power that can dispel evil. Can't? I mean, I mean, Both Zelda can kind of powers like. powers will help you protect your own era. Zelda can kind of like r remain calm too, because like Queen our era is fine. Oh and well, actually, no, maybe it's not. Maybe not. Right. Link. That is not a name I have heard. He is a royal knight. Oh, that's he how Raru heard of originally us. Originally appointed for my protection. Zelda told him, but him later, of us in the he past. He became a hero by saving both me and Hyrule from a great evil. Oh, a hero is he? He is so very dedicated, and he refuses to back down from any challenge. <sighs> Aww. He is very strong. <laughs> And his heart is good and true. She likes him. <laughs> uh, Zelda and Link sitting in a tree. Absolute faith in him. <laughs> Hearing you speak so highly of Link, I find myself wanting to meet him as well. Indeed. I would also like to meet him. He must be quite the brave, courageous knight. What a picture Zelda paints of him. <laughs> this does give me pause. <laughs> Because, I mean, Raru, we ended up meeting Raru. And that's why, you know, at the very beginning of the game, he was so fond of us. It's like, I'm so glad I got to meet you, finally. But, um, what happened to Sonya? 